guys, uh, this is my second vlog post of today. Uh, the earlier one I was talking about uh, relationships, but today, in this video, uh, we're going to talk about uh, a word, it's called the ask hole. All right. So it's a, it's a new word that I came across recently and I want to explain to you what it means and, and, and how it actually applies to you. All right. So uh, we've all heard of asshole and that's the American way of uh, asshole basically. It says someone's like a turd or something, but um, and and there's, there's the British version, which is called the arsehole, which is spelled a little bit differently. So uh, the British version, uh, they spell they spell it as an A R S E H O L E. Okay, but now I'm gonna tell you about the third one, and the third one is called the asshole. Okay, it's totally different from asshole and arsehole. Asshole and arsehole are practically the same thing, but the asshole is. Is uh, is someone that we're going to probably experience quite a lot, in, especially in in the direct sales business, or in fact, uh, in any service-oriented business where you make direct contacts with people, and especially if some of you are in teaching roles. Um, I mean, actually, teaching roles not too bad, but uh, you you might not experience it that much. But if you're in the direct sales ones, you're gonna get it a lot. Okay, so. What exactly is an asshole? Right? An asshole is a person who tends to ask you for a lot of ideas and opinions, um, and then at the end of it, after you're you're done giving them your whole thesis or your whole um, you know your whole uh, whatever conjecture or whatever uh, detailed explanation, these people still go on to do things the same way they the same way they would have done it if they hadn't asked you, or perhaps they go and do the totally opposite thing. All right. And the end result is that it's just infuriating. Okay, so this kind of reminds me of like uh, two, three days ago, a friend of mine uh, on Facebook, his name is uh, Don, I believe. Uh, he he was writing about this uh, this it, it's a very funny dude. He was like a wannabe um, wannabe Asian kung fu master guy. You know, it's, it's wannabe when he, he really was like a, a white window cleaner. It's kind of funny. Yeah, and, and he gave, even gave himself like a, his whole Asian name thing. Uh, and the deal with him was that uh, he was talking to my buddy about some online business and he's trying to find out like how how uh, Don makes money online. So Don kind of like uh, laid it out for him and, and then this guy starts talking about how that's how that's uh, uh, immoral and how that's uh, you know it's wrong and how it's like how it, it doesn't conform to to uh, Buddhism and stuff. I was like, I mean, seriously, look at that. I've got, I've got so many people in this business who are Buddhists that, that have no issues. I mean, look at Justin Berenger, right? He's Buddhist. And look at, and and in fact, like, uh, you know, con Confucianism is all about abundance, right? So that's my example of asshole. Obviously, another case would be, uh, I, I've, I've had so many run ins with assholes and, and, and those are the kind of people that actually uh, made me want to stop doing all this uh, this one on one connection uh, you know uh, networking on Facebook because it's just it's just freaking emotionally draining, you know. When you give out a lot and people don't take your advice and then they spend on they spend on something else uh, they didn't recommend. In many cases they spend a lot more on something else they didn't recommend. Like uh, someone gets the thirty-five hundred dollar thing, when you recommend it, the ninety-seven dollar thing, and then uh, and then they, they complain that you know no, they kind of they kind of like react like it's your fault. So that's what you call the ask for. I right, hope that cleared it up. And and uh, in the comments below, it'd be cool uh, if you could share with me what kind of ask holes you have actually met in your career in online marketing or, or in direct sales or in and just in life, alright? I'll see you in the next video.